All right, I'm in the kitchen with Chef Erkut Caritas from Mas Tapas y Vino at the beautiful Hotel Andalus. Chef, what are we making today? Today we're making um, lemon artichoke stuffed uh, rabbit thighs. Wow, okay. Yeah, we will wrap them with prosciutto and we will make them sit on um, butternut squash cream and some uh, mushroom medley. Holy moly. All right, so what goes into making this dish? This sounds uh, incredible. So what are we using to make this? Um, <clears throat> well, this actually came up really quick. Um, these days we are um, getting ready for um, seafood festival. Mm -hmm. Um, will happen tomorrow actually at the biopark and it's open for public mm -hmm. and we're expecting over 600 people. Wow. Um, yeah, uh, we are getting ready for that. Uh, I'll, I'll make paella valenciana. That's why I have uh, rabbits in stock right at the moment. Gotcha, so in okay. a few days we will run a special also. So it's not very common. Uh, yeah. Protein. Yeah, ex protein. absolutely. Yeah, not a very common protein. Uh, of course, the question everyone's going to ask: What does rabbit usually do? Does it taste like chicken? Ravioli? No, rabbit. Does a it rabbit. Taste like chicken? Oh, the texture is pretty close to mm -hmm. the chicken. Um, slightly different, mm -hmm. and sometimes it depends on where you get it. Uh, if it comes from um, farm, mm -hmm. it's different. But okay. if you get it wild uh, with the hunt, they are a little more chewy. You need okay. to cook them longer maybe like confit. Gotcha. All so right. Well, we're going to be there. talking about this dish throughout the show. We are back in the kitchen with Urku Caratas from uh, Mas Tapas y Vino at the beautiful Hotel Andalus. You guys celebrating 75 years. Yes. And we're making uh, somewhat of an unusual dish. We're using wabbits today. Yes. Is that right? Okay. So where are we in the process of making this dish? Well, while you guys hanging out with the sweet <laughs> dog Jack. <laughs> well, we're hanging out. That's yeah, right. I on the rabbits and the uh -huh. I season the rabbits. And meanwhile, I lay them on the sliced prosciutto. Mm -hmm. And this is the trick that we would like to bake them in the foil. Oh, OK. Yeah, so it holds it together, keeps the juice together. Uh -huh. And maybe after you bake it, close to the finishing time, maybe last five minutes, some people like their uh, prosciutto a little crunchier. Mm -hmm. Or you can make with the bacon. Okay. So you can give it like a little crunchiness at the end. Mm -hmm. um, so let's uh, stuff our rabbit thighs. Okay. With Lemon or um now what is this? What are we putting in here? Lemon risotto. This is the lemon risotto, okay. Yep. Not very very generous amount, uh -huh. just to be able to we want to be able to wrap the um rabbits. Gotcha, okay. So we can start this way. This is the wheel that we want to end up with. Uh-huh. So after we roll it all together, mm -hmm. each side we need to lock it up. Okay. Just like making s homemade sausage. Right, okay. So this is good to go to the oven. Okay, uh, and that goes into the oven. How yeah. long does it go into the oven for and at what um, temperature? Three, 350 uh, up to 20, 22 minutes. Because okay. depends on the sum of the ovens. Some of them faster, some of them smaller. And um, this depends on the, if you're cooking something more in the oven, mm -hmm. of course, it's going to affect uh, timing. Uh -huh. So I recommend like, 160, 165. Okay. To make sure it's all the way cooked. So okay. This is what we're gonna cook right now. Okay. So it's going in just like that. Yep. Okay. And so we'll put that in, and of course, uh, through the magic of television, uh, 30 minutes or so turns into just a couple of minutes. Yep. And uh, we will be checking back in. We're gonna be diving into the dish before the show is done, because I can't. I don't think I've ever had rabbit, so I'm very excited about this. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah. All right. So we. All right, welcome back, folks. It is going to be a scorcher today here in Albuquerque, near record temperatures. We are in the kitchen now with uh, Chef Erkut Caracas from Hotel Andalus, Mas Tapas y Vino. So uh, we've got this prepared dish. Now, first, uh, tell us again what is in this. This is yes. kind of an unusual meat. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't want to come here where common meats mm. like ribeye or New York strip, something mm -hmm. like that. Um, yeah, why bother <laughs> with those? Yeah, come on. Uh, <laughs> a few minutes ago, as I said, uh, we will be participating in uh, Rock to Boat Seafood Festival. Mm -hmm. um, me and Chef Caruso, mm -hmm. we will be representing our hotel. Mm -hmm. And um, I will stuff the mussels with paella valenciana, which mm -hmm. makes the paella valenciana is different than regular paella. Mm -hmm. okay. It has rabbit in it. So that's why um, mm. we have a rabbit in the house right now. Mm -hmm. um, 
So now you were saying earlier in the show that that the the texture, the flavor of rabbit can depend on where it's sourced from. If it's it's farm versus where exactly. it, whether you hunt it. Why is that? Because uh, farm uh, animals don't move a lot, and okay. so their muscles are a lot tender than that makes sense. Other oh, okay. animals, because the wild ones constantly run. Constantly moving. Yeah. yeah, and the farm ones not move, don't They're move a down. lot, and uh, right. they eat them. Lay down. All right. That's, that's <laughs> yeah. like me. Yeah. I, that's what I was like, just like Chad. No, yeah, just exactly. kidding. Oh, just thanks, kidding. Britt. Thanks. So, of course, uh, we were talking about the fact that the Hotel Andalus is celebrating 75 years. Yep. Um, big celebration. Big celebration. In June, it, so each month you guys had a different sort of themed celebration for the decades that you've been open. So what is going on in June? Uh, we have a big uh, celebration on uh, Friday. Mm -hmm. um, we will be serving uh, some special items from the mass. Mm -hmm. um, each guest m might enjoy as, as well as they enjoy the um, show. Mm -hmm. okay. and so it will be an exciting event. So yeah. you're saying that, that there's a show as well? Is that what you were saying? Yes. Okay, so tell us about the show. What are we going to be seeing? Okay, uh, <clears throat> we are expecting the dancers and such nice um, um, some the, we have a really nice menu for the mm -hmm. guests. Okay. Yep. Okay. And so there's going to be dancing? Dancing because yes. the food's so good? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Plus yeah. you've got uh, the great, I mean, there's so many things uh, that are fantastic about the Andalus. One of my personal things about going to the Andalus and, and dining and hanging out with friends is the upstairs patio. This mm -hmm. gorgeous, Absolutely. gorgeous view of downtown, yes. of the yep. Sandias, of, of Albuquerque. Now to be part of this celebration, do we need to make reservations? Yes. Yeah. So Make reservations, reservations have to be made, and we're, we're, we're expecting a full house. Uh, we are trying to welcome as much as we can the mm -hmm. walking guests, but mm -hmm. sometimes uh, when we have a lot of guests, it's kind of... Yeah. Well, there's only so much you can do, especially yeah. if the fire yeah. marshal knows that you guys are going to be a party. <laughs> yeah, we don't want to get There's literally only that. so Absolutely. much that you can yep. do. Okay, so um, I, we've got this ready. Uh, do we, is this, uh, I'm assuming this isn't finger food. We don't just, because I look at this and I think I know, of like I'm a like, burrito. Yeah. Exactly, you're like, I'm just going to take that. That's not but the way to eat this. We should use forks, is what you're saying. <laughs> Please. Okay. Yeah, forks. Okay, use before forks. we destroy we this, let's see. Well, I'm going to grab a couple of these the here. Okay. Uh, so we can cut into it, and I'll find some forks here. So, and there's mushrooms with this. Did you do anything special with mushrooms? Um, I put three Maybe kinds forks. of mushrooms all together okay. white mushrooms, creamy, and portobellos. Um, but don't limit yourself. You can make only one kind or five kinds. Okay. It doesn't have to be exactly this way. And as I said a few minutes ago, it doesn't have to be wrapped with prosciutto. Yeah. You can wrap it with bacon. Or you don't have to okay. wrap it. Or we're gonna have to. Or get you can just not wrap it. Yeah. Okay. Or stopping. You don't have to stop it. It's we gotta all get creative here because we don't have any forks. Yeah, it's all oh up to your man. creativity. Here, okay. See. All right. So Very I'm just gonna. Cool. I'm gonna. Well, okay, I can't so wait to try this, and oh, I'm gonna wow. try it after the break. Stay right there.